Hey viewers and friends, Andrew back again and welcome to another video and this video is going to be another segment of the Movie World Tour and this time it's covering Asian cinema. Now I was contemplating whether to do this video or not because I only actually own uh, five movies from Asia in my collection and out of those five I've only seen two of them so far. So it's pretty pitiful but I wanted to continue to support this challenge because I think it's an awesome idea. And in my opinion, nowhere near enough people are involved in this. Um, it's really pitiful and disappointing, guys, the fact that there's hardly anyone involved in this challenge. I mean, considering the large movie buff community we've got here, and it's a fantastic idea. It's not just covering one genre, guys. It's covering world cinema. And honestly, there's no excuse not to get involved. I mean, I know people are busy and all that, but... Honestly, can't you spare five to ten minutes to shoot a video and then you can upload it while you're doing other stuff? I mean, it's really not that hard, but really disappointing um, that more people aren't involved in this. But anyway, so I wanted to continue on with this challenge, even though I've only got five video movies to show. So let's get into it. Um, so the first one is Battle Royale. This is the Arrow Blu-ray release. This movie is phenomenal. It was actually the very first Asian movie that I ever saw and absolutely fell in love with it. I love the storyline. Um, anyone who's familiar with Asian cinema has seen this and knows how amazing it is. So, Battle Royale. Um, the next one I got sent to me from Danny or DJ Boy. So thanks a lot if you're watching this. And that is I Saw the Devil. This movie is fucking fantastic. I absolutely love it. Um, I'm sure a lot of people have seen this one, but if you haven't and you're a fan of Asian cinema, I cannot recommend this enough. Absolutely amazing, beautifully shot, amazing cast, and really, really gripping storyline. It kind of blends a lot of different genres into this one. You've got your horror elements. Um, during the movie, it reminded me a little bit of the Texas Chainsaw Massacre, especially... Um, in the house, it really reminded me of that, and the... Um, serial killer's house and all that and then you've got the revenge aspect um, so the storyline behind this one is it's about a um, high art professional businessman who's seeking revenge over his wife's murder um, his wife got murdered by a serial killer so he tracks him down and he catches up with him numerous times throughout the movie pretty much tortures him beats him up and then backs off um, yeah, really, really good. Um, absolutely brutal. So um, I thought it was fantastic. So I saw the devil. And then the next three I have not actually seen yet. Um, but a lot of people have mentioned them and they're pretty high up in Asian cinema. We have A Tale of Two Sisters. I have seen the remake to this and really enjoyed it. So looking forward to checking this one out. Um, next up is A Bittersweet Life, which I recently picked up about a month ago. Uh, really, really cheap, and it's from the same director who did I Saw the Devil, so looking forward to checking it out. I've had a discussion with uh, Luke about this movie, and he said it's really, really good. And then the last one is Audition. So there are other Asian movies that I do plan to pick up, like Battle Royale 2, uh, confession or confessions uh, neighbor number 13 the suicide club and um, old boy or the whole lady vengeance trilogy so there's a few more I want to add to the collection but yeah pretty pitiful collection compared to a lot of people that have uploaded videos um, for the segment but still I wanted to show the support and upload a video so Guys, please get involved with this. Um, I'll be leaving Pharaoh 1990's channel link in the description box below. So you can easily click on it and uh, check out the previous videos in this series. So that's it. Thanks a lot for watching.